it's slightly reassuring to hear that Farage uh, fell into trouble because his bank demands that he has a certain reserve, a certain amount of money in the bank. Um, and when it falls below that much, the bank's not interested. This is Coots. Surely everybody knew that Coots had a sort of uh, wealth ratio, um, that a standard account at uh, Coots demands uh, a certain a certain amount uh, kept in the bank. And that's why Coots would say it was a commercial decision, and presumably anybody that uh, Nigel Farage approached would have told him this. Uh, he's kicked up a fuss about very little. And, um, you know, unless you're the Queen Mother, in which case you have a £2 million overdraft, you have to have, I think, a million pound or £3 million in savings in the account in, in order to keep your bank. Um, and, uh, yeah, so Farage was making a lot of fuss over nothing and um, making a mountain out of a molehill. As for the idea that he can't get a bank account with anybody else, I would have thought the fact that he's had a bank account with Coots was enough to guarantee him an account with Nat West or with Barclays, unless, of course, he's kicked up such a fuss that he's made himself persona non grata, which wouldn't surprise me.